Hi there, I'm Gabriel, and this is uh, part of my Easy Yoga in 3 Minute series, uh, which will run anywhere from 2 to 6 minutes. So this is um, the uh, forward bend is what I'm going to focus on in this one. And the forward bend is not to be, uh, not to be dismissed as just a uh, plain old simple easy stretching that, you know, kids do at soccer um, uh, practice or whatever. The forward bend uh, is pretty powerful in and of itself, and I'm going to show a few different variations on it. So first of all, obviously, is just the, the plain old forward bend. Stand straight, feet together. I'm on a sort of uneven surface here, but I'll do the best I can. Um, bring the arms overhead, and the important thing is to bend from the hip. Don't, don't go like this. Bend from the hip. And then come down. And an important point to keep in mind, you don't want to reach for your toes. Instead, you want to relax towards your toes. It's the relaxing of the muscles um, that allows them to stretch. If you're, if you're pushing it and you're trying to, you know, you're looking at your toes and you're thinking, I should touch my toes, um, uh, you know, say, say that you're here and you're pushing it, then you're, you're going to be straining things instead of relaxing them. Instead, don't worry about touching your toes. Just relax into the, into the bend and allow those muscles to relax. And you might be surprised at what happens within a minute or two of how much further you stretch when you simply allow those muscles to relax. Now, uh, another uh, thing that you can do in the course of the forward band as you're coming down, stop, right here. If you think, uh, if you think the forward band is for sissies, try this one and see how long you can, you can do it, especially if you're sticking yourself out pretty straight. Um, this is not an easy stretch. It really stretches a lot of your body. It's a good one. And then come down. And now another variation to take yourself further into it. Bring the hands behind the back, up and over, and allow your arms to fall towards your head. And this will push you further into the stretch. And now, um, hold as long as you like. You can, you can hang there in a forward bend for 5-10 minutes and it's going to uh, work wonders on you. Um, so uh, don't be in any rush to, you know, go through these. You know, st stay with them. And then I'll do one, one other thing that isn't a forward bend, but while you're standing here, Hopefully I can be fully seen within the video frame here. Bring the hands uh, clasped together and then go out like this and then come up. And in case uh, I can't be, my hands can't be seen above the video screen, the hands are just like this stretching outwards and then you're bringing them up and your palms are facing towards the ceiling or the sky as the case may be. And now come up on your tippy toes and push upwards and allow yourself to stretch upwards as much as you can. And then just hold that for as long as you possibly can. And then when you're done, come down back left foot and then do a little stretch to the left, keeping everything as straight as you possibly can. And then just hold it for five, 10, 15 seconds, as long as you like. Come up, go to the other side. Again, come up, other side, and then just go back and forth and do that several times, as many times as you like. And then just come back to center, take several deep breaths and allow yourself to incorporate those movements and allow that energy to flow and subside. Allow yourself to relax into your body more. Thank you for watching. Namaste.